Okay, so this is my attempt at giving Masaban her first bath. First thing is first, we are going to remove everything from around the sink. So Okay, so now we have a clear sink space. Next, I'm just going to go grab the towel that I'm going to use for her and her shampoo. The shampoo that I'm using, I got from Big W, so it's Rufus and Coco. Two-in-one oatmeal and aloe wash hypoallergenic shampoo and conditioner. It, it contains oatmeal oil, it's hypoallergenic, contains aloe vera, paraben-free, pH balanced, and soap. Free. I will give you a close-up Like I said, I got it from Big W and I think it was only like $15 or something like that I have her towel that I'm just going to leave right here And then I have a Kong toy that is dripping with peanut butter And then last but not least, I have da -da -da -da, my puppy So Let's see how this goes First, let's sit her in the sink. Just let her sniff, sniffle, sniffle. <laughs> yeah she smells a little bit better so as you can tell by my sports bra this is after shower time um, I thought I would just end the video with some uh, I guess tips on how to give your puppy a first bath or you know what not I'm not even gonna say tips because 
I don't know, this is only what worked for me. You got the actual real live footage of me giving puppy her first bath and I don't think it went that bad. I did not wash her head, like behind her ears or the top of her head. You know what? The most important thing was her body because she had been itching and biting at it. So I just wanted to see if the oatmeal shampoo would stop that. So we'll see, she's still drying off right now and she's very much into her She's very much into her bully stick, if you can't see here in the little corner. I just kept it with her while she dries off a little bit more and I just have her sitting on the towel. Um, but yes, yeah, so we'll start from the beginning. She is only, uh, how old are you? She'll be 11, she'll be 11 weeks tomorrow. And the first time I tried to kind of clean her off, I didn't give her a bath. I just used some puppy wipes. So I use these Baby Power Scented Antibacterial Pet Wipes from Absorb Plus. I guess that's what they're called. So I just got these from Pet Stock, I think. No, I got these from My Pet Warehouse, I believe. Um, and yeah, they actually smell really good. And I use them just to wipe off her paws as well. If they're feeling a little bit sticky or if we're outside a little bit dirty, I'll just use those as well as for cleaning her head because like I said, we didn't get to do that in our bath today. So I think just to get the puppies used to feeling like wet, <laughs> I would start off with just wiping their entire body with some pet wipes, which is what I did with Masa a couple a week ago, a couple of weeks ago, and then also I would occasionally bring her into the bathroom by the sink and just I would just turn the water on, which at first she like did not like, she was scared of and she didn't even want to go anywhere near it, but then uh, I just did it a couple more times, just turning on the water and um, just sticking her paw under there for a couple of seconds just so she would kind of get used to what the water on her felt like. And then, yeah, that's pretty much all I did to pre-prep her for her bath. Okay, so this little one seems to be almost dry, so I think it's time to take away her bully stick. And I hope you all found this video at least a little bit helpful. Good luck on your first puppy baths. Let me know how it goes down below in the comments. I would love to hear your stories. And yeah, we will see you in our next video. Bye!